Push the goddamn button. Push the goddamn button. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Go ahead and click that red button right there. And also click that bell for notifications and select all. Alright. Yo, 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 yo. This is Games and Graphics. We are back in the building with another GTA 5 mod tutorial for you. And we are still installing Open 4 packages with our Open 4 package creator, all right? Uh, today we are going to be using this to make a package for a replaced car, all right? So um, the requirements you are going to need, first of all, is uh, Open 4 package creator. When you get to this page right here, you want to scroll down. Always read the description before you download any script or mod. After you're done reading the description, Come right here where it says current and select the green arrow to download this one right here is created by felix bartling all right shout out to the creator the next big requirement you are going to need is open four all right we will not be installing open four uh but we will be um doing the open four package creator but open four i will leave a link in the description to a video showing you how to install open four if you don't have that installed already all right so make sure you check out the links in the description for all the requirements okay so once you have your open four package creator downloaded and you have your open four installed on my left hand side i actually have the open four package creator already opened up right here and um if you open it up inside it's going to have a setup application what you want to do is go ahead and select setup and then you want to select modify and then it's going to say main feature make sure that that is checked right here and then you want to select modify then select yes and then it's going to tell you open for package creator has been successfully installed okay then you want to select finish all right now also um as you can see i have my replace car files right here you are also going to need uh some replace car files um so you can follow the tutorial with me i'm pretty sure you have some replace car files if you don't then you could also visit the same site that open for package creator is on and then go inside vehicles and find yourself a replaced car okay once you have your replaced car files ready you're all good to go let's go ahead and minimize this window right here and after you go ahead and install open for package you will see that there will be a icon on your desktop all right it's going to be this one right here go ahead and double click it when you double click it it'll be this little box that opens up right here go ahead and select ok now this is the main focus right here is our open for package creator all right so i'm going to leave it checked as grant that photo 5. for this one i'm going to name this one uh to do uh, car replace car i just name it 69 i think it's a 69 charger or challenger actually all right and i'm just gonna go ahead and place one right there and i'm gonna go to author and just put gg description place in mods folder optional license design you could also create your own design right here by uh, putting in your own logo or um, changing the color and the font in the background as well if you want and then the last tab is files that's where we are going to be creating um, our path to where we want to install our files at so from this point we want to open up our open form all right, I got my open four opened up right here on my right hand side. You want to make sure that you have your edit mode turned on right here at the top right of open four. Go ahead and select it and turn it on. Once it's turned on, you can go ahead and find the path where you want to install your replace car. Okay, for me, I am installing my replace car in my replace car mods folder. I will leave a link in the description to where you could uh, download that as well. All right. So for me, I'm going to go inside my mods folder and then I want to start off with update because that is exactly where my DLC packs is at is in update. All right. Um, also, very important information before we go any further, I'm bringing back up my Grand Theft Auto 5 directory, which is right here. 
Now, before we go any further, you want to make sure that you have a mods folder, okay? So just in case you're watching and you don't have a mods folder, go ahead and create a mods folder and name it mods, all in low caps. Once you're done doing that, you want to come down to the update folder and you want to copy, all right? You want to copy the update folder, all right? Copy this whole folder. Then go back to that mods folder that you just created. Open up that mods folder you just created. And then you want to paste that update folder right inside the mods folder. All right. Once you have that pasted, um, you are all good to go. All right. Now we can go ahead and minimize our Grand Theft Auto 5 directory and continue with um, installing our files in our Open4 package creator. All right. So let's go back to our Open4 package creator. Select root. Root is always going to be the Grand Theft Auto 5 directory. All right. That is where we're always going to start off from. So what I need to do is select uh, this icon up here, which is a folder, and this is a file, and this is archive, and the last one is trash, all right? So what I wanna do now is select the folder, and I wanna name that update, and then submit. And the next one is going to be X64. Now let me just bring these kind of close right here so you can kind of see what I'm doing on both, all right? So I am just taking the path where I'm going right here in Open4 and making the path in Open4 Creator. Oops, there we go. Make sure you spell everything uh, correctly. Right, DLC packs and oh nope i don't want to go in there i want to go inside my replace folder i'm just gonna copy the name right there over here select the folder again all right replace submit now i can go inside that replace and inside that replace folder i have a uh, archive so what i want to do is go back to the uh, open for package creator select replace and then go up here and select the uh, add new archive icon and now i get to name it i'm gonna name it doc.rpf since it's a, a archive whenever it's an archive always um add the dot rpf at the end okay select submit all right now go over here now we need another folder and name that X64. And then uh, vehicles.rpf, so I need another archive. Add new archive. And this is vehicles.rpf. Submit. All right. So now at this point, we could go ahead and um, find our files to uh, install. So now that um, you are at the end of your path and you are ready to add your files, you wanna come up here to where it says add new file, select that. And then you wanna go ahead and locate the files of the car that you wanna add. Mine is right here, so I'm gonna go ahead and select it. You can only select one at a time. You, can, you cannot uh, double select. As you can see, it's only let me select one at a time, all right? So select one, then select open. Then make sure that uh, your archive or your, or your folder is highlighted and then add another file if you have multiple ones. All right. Now when you have all of your car files added uh, and you're all good to go, just come over here where it says create, select create. Now you wanna go ahead and select the destination where you wanna save it at. I'm going to save it in the same place I have my Open4 app, my Open4 creator, uh, package creator app, and I'ma name this uh, 69, oops, I have to highlight that box, 69 Challenger. And then hit save. After you do that, you'll be greeted with this little box that says, thank you for using Open4 Package Creator. Um, once we do that, let's go ahead and select OK, and then we'll exit out. Now, if we bring back up uh, this folder right here, 
Now earlier, um, I just had the open for package creator and then I had my uh, replace car files. Now if you see right here, I have a 69 Challenger OIV file, all right? So um, from this point, um, what I could do is just uh, drag and drop this inside of open four. So I'm just gonna grab the highlighted 69 Challenger or whatever car that you made, grab it and drag and drop it right here. And a package installer window should open up right here, okay? And uh, you can also do this as well. You can just double click it and it'll open up also. So once you have it opened up, uh, you will see the um, information that you would put in the description. For me, I just put place in mods folder. And then uh, you have your author name right here, which I just put GG. And um, once you're done, you know, checking out everything, go ahead and press install. And now you want to select your mods folder, okay? Because that's where you um, had the path going to was inside your mods folder. So select mods folder and then select install confirm installation. All right, then you'll get a message saying that your uh, installation succeeded. You could go ahead and open up the installation log to check any further um, information that you might need or something like that. By actually checking in this log, it kind of um, opened up my eyes to, you know, exactly where to put things at and how to, you know, uh, arrange things when I'm making my open four packages. So this could be very helpful also. Your uh, installation log could be located right here. When you're done, go ahead and click close. And at this point, our replace car has automatically been installed. So we can go ahead and exit out of open four, minimize any other windows that we have open and run the game. The other I don't night. know if I can take this city bet much you longer. Did too. <laughs> yeah, I bet you did. That's All right, I'm so at this you. point, um, we just want to open up our trainer or mod menu, and we want to look for uh, our replace car that we just installed. Now I believe I replaced the Vigero. Vig I think it's uh, is it this one? This one, this one of these. Okay, there we go. Alright, so there goes my 69 Challenger right here. Alright, yep, that's the Challenger. Alright, so that worked right there, y'all. We just made our first uh, OIV package for a replace car. Alright. So next time we'll see if we can uh, make our OIV package of um, some add-on cars, right? We'll uh, do one add-on car and then after that we'll make another video doing multiple add-on cars and one OIV package, alright? So y'all stay tuned for that. Oh, we're out of here, we ain't got no shirts. <laughs> But if this helps y'all out to install it, man, if y'all enjoyed this video, man, make sure that y'all smash that like button. Definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And share the video with y'all friends that are in the modding GTA 5, y'all. It's the Games of Graphics, me and Big Paul and Ass Frank. We are out next to next time. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.